Hello! Hi, Tide here. Back to another video. Now, this is a very interesting video because I'm going to be playing through uh, my game. This game is now out of development. It is a full game. It is not a good game, so don't get mad at that. It is meant to look horrible. Meant to be horrible. So, yeah. I hope you're ready. So, let's just get straight into this. Alright, so here we are. Level 1. I'm on controller, by the way, because it's better to play on controller. Uh, here we are. This is called, this, his name is Django. Yep, he's just there. I think you're putting collectibles in, to, uh, in the next game, which will be Awesome Sauce 3. And I'm already starting to work on that one. So, let's just go ahead and do I have a interact button? I forgot to add an interact button, so E. Now, when you're up here, I need to remove this before I put this, the full game on H.io, but... If you go that, if you go to the right, uh, it's infinite. So I'm just gonna go all the way to the left now. I just gotta keep moving to the left. Oops, I put my joystick down. I just gotta keep moving to the left, and it'll put me into the next level soon. Right now, 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 now. Yes. Okay. Now here we are. These will not kill you, but this lava, and it will kill you. Just gotta watch out. It's a little bit of parkour here. Okay. I'm just bad. So here you are. There we go. This is a checkpoint. So now if I die there, I'll respawn there. And this is where I was gonna put one of the collectibles. But yeah, that didn't work out. Couldn't figure out the script for it. So I'm just gonna keep going. Now this thing I should also fix before I put gets into the full game. This thing you have to walk with it in order to go on it, which I need to change that because it's annoying. Anyway, next level. Now, there's nothing here this way, but then if you go to the left, there is lasers are bad. Lasers will kill you if you touch them. Just like every game in the world. And you can't jump on ice. You can hear how much I'm mashing the button. Yeah, you cannot jump on ice. And I'm dumb. So that's a boulder there. So this boulder will roll back and forth um, in about eight seconds, and you just got just got to jump over it. All right, come at me, come at me, come at me, come at me. Let's go. Now I'm gonna go on here, so we're gonna go over here. Oops. And there are troll endings, so I just thought I'd put that in there. Uh, so what you're gonna do instead is you're gonna go over here and you're gonna fall down. And we are on to the next level. So, let's just get going again. Now I have to press E again. And those are teleporters, by the way. So those, when you're standing on top of them, you can teleport to the next one back and forth as many, as many times as you want. But let's get keep going. So there's spikes there. Those will kill you if you touch them just like there. Now here, I it looks like you could just jump across, but I put an invisible kill brick there. So you cannot jump across there. You have to use the, the teleporter. There we go. Hit a checkpoint, and we can go right to the end. There should be a couple more spikes. Yeah. Oops. And we are at the end. Oh, no, I died. Okay. There we go. Now, this is dark, right? I know, I know. There's lights on. And if you step here... Yep. Lights disappear and the light switch plays. So here. So you can't jump on the ice again, but there is a falling icicle here. So you gotta watch out. And more lasers. I don't know, particles there. Now here, there should be a laser that comes right up to here. And then you gotta run with it because then it's gonna go up again. There you go. Now these are accurate spikes. Or accu spikes. Now, the hitbox, what I tried to uh, display there with the drawing, 
is the hitbox is exact. So wherever you see the black on the spike is exactly the hitbox. So let's just be careful not to die there. Okay. And now there is a checkpoint here, as you can see. I just completely forgot to layer it in front of the background. So the background is in front of the spike. Now there is an annoying there is an annoying thing right about here. It is a huge spike. There we go. Now here, you have to be careful because you see how the spike is sticking up above that platform? If you land like that, you'll die. But, so you have to jump, you have to jump past it. And in here, the same, thi same thing, you have to watch out because you will die. And now here, there was a bug where you would die if you get squished, but now I made it so you just teleport on top. I did not make this music. Anyway, let's jump, jump, and we are in the next level. This is an annoying level. I know how to do this, but these are semi-transparent blocks, so you can stand on them as long as you want, but they will go invisible, invisible, fading. So you could just go all over. Some of the camera is a bad angle, or the camera is a bad angle in this level, so you just have to make a jump of faith sometimes. There we go. Now, next one. This, one of my friends came over to my house one day and, and I asked them, what do you want to add to the game? And they're like, I don't know. So I added an I don't know. And the literal I don't know, as you can see there. So here, you would also die if you touch the water there. And the spikes. Uh, so what this is, <laughs> this is one object, by the way. And that says, I don't know, and then an air, down arrow, not my, and then not, not my idea. So that's that. Now, here, you just gotta wait for an elevator that will come down. And once the elevator, there's an invisible wall right now. The invisible wall will disappear when the elevator gets here. Here's the elevator. Now the invisible wall's gone. And then, like, as soon as the elevator starts moving again, the invisible wall is back. And now here, hold, press and hold S, or, Y, or X. X on the Xbox controller. I don't know what it is on the Nintendo Switch or whatever, but it's X on the Xbox controller to crouch. And you can go past. Now what you can do is you can jump over here. There is a checkpoint there. Now you have to crouch. Oops. Now you do have to crouch to get past here, or if you stand, you will die because you get squished. Now what we could do is we could jump over a few spikes here, a few spikes here. And go to the next level. Here we are, and we can crouch now, throughout the, all the rest of the levels. Now there is a spinny thing here, which, yeah, it spins. Uh, it flattens out and then goes the other direction time to time. So you have to make it quick, time it right, because then it stops, and then you can go over here, there's a checkpoint. Now there's some stairs here that form and go back down. Now here, if you jump normally, you cannot make that. You cannot make this. So you have to be crouch jumping. So you have to crouch jump there. So you have to boop, boop. That's crouch jump. Now, here's another one of those areas. So you have to walk with it and then jump over. Now there, you will hit your head on the wall, or on the roof, so you have to crouch jump again then. There we go. Now the music stops here because I couldn't find any more music to use. Now those, as you just saw, are jump pads. So there, you obviously jump much higher when you're not, or when you're touching those than when you're not. So I'm not touching it, touching it. Not touching, touching. So you can jump up there, just jump, jump, jump. Now teleport there, now go walk over, teleport there. Now we'll up, up, up. Now this is an ele another elevator, so you wait here until that progress bar goes down, and then an elevator will appear, and you could just walk right in there, and it's perfectly shaped just so you could fit in there. And there you go. Now you're in the elevator, and you can just go up now. See you on the other side.
Now, once you're at the top, it'll push you out and close it after. Now, you can fall back down there, so do not do that. Anyway, so over here, there is some boxes. You just push those off, and now there's some fish. Now, watch out for the fish, because the fish will kill you. And on to the next one. I'll give you a chance to read that if you want to. Alrighty. So, now here is an interesting thing. It's here. Alright. And now, press P to access your phone. I will not do that in this tutorial. Or not this tutorial, but this playthrough. Now here, my friend also made this idea. It's a grandma shooting children out of a gun. Not shooting children with a gun. Shooting children out of a gun. So, yeah. Anyway, this is the boss fight. Yeah, no, you just click no. Alrighty. Now, this is World 2. Very interesting world because or one level because it is not the camera doesn't move with you anymore it, it's all like that so here you just push that there i think there's a bug right now yeah where you do that and it like really bugs out the physics of the boxes it's so weird anyway what you do here is you push this box all the way over to the side so then you can jump on it or if you're a pro you could just whoop anyway And then once you're up there, you can jump over onto that, go over, exactly like that, and down and over, and then up here. Now the next level. This level is a pretty small one. I, re I, re I really mess with the um, little jump pad mechanics and scripts here. So this is another elevator, it pushes you all the way up, and then you can't go back down because it'll stop you. Right here, this platform you cannot go back under, so it'll go back down, and you can't go back down. Anyway, now this jump pad I have really edited a little bit. Alrighty, now this level is the end of the game. So, yeah, that is Awesome Sauce 2. Uh, stay tuned for Awesome Sauce 3, and yeah, hope you enjoyed. See ya.